guys, what is going on? Um, today I have a little surprise video for you. Um, this tutorial is going to tell you how to use Google Voice for the iPhone. I know this has been widely suggested and people have been wanting it for a while. And this is not an official app, app it's a web app, but it is a way to use Google Voice on your iPhone. So as you can see I have it down there in the bottom right and it's called um, Voice Central. Um, it's by it's called Blackhawk by Voice Central. And what you need to do is you need to open up your web browser on your iPhone. So there you go, I'll open up Safari. And I'll go to this site. Load it up here. Sorry guys, wrong one. Okay, here's the site. And all you have to do is zoom in. And you'll enter your first name, last name, Google Voice email, and you'll re-enter your Google Voice email. And then you will also enter this little code that they give you. And you will select free or premium. And then uh, once you submit that, it will bring you to a little page to uh, save the icon to your home screen, which you do so. And then you have this little icon on your screen. And that is the app for Google Voice. So I'll go ahead and open it up for you guys. Again, this is completely free. Um, Okay, and as you can see, this app is similar to the iPhone calling app, like the phone app. Um, I'll go through the bottom five tabs. Recents, uh, contacts, SMS, um, voicemail, keypad, and settings. Um, all, five, all six of these tabs, depending on what you want to do, they can help you with Google Voice. Um, I'll go through the settings. Obviously, you can edit your account info and your billing info and you can also edit your contact displays, contact sorting and uh, your callback number. Uh, keypad is obviously to dial your numbers that you want to call. Voicemail is where it will, will store all of your Google Voice voicemails. SMS is where you can uh, write new text messages. Um, and if you also click the upper right right here you can see that's how you start a new text message and you can call any number. Contacts is obviously just your contacts. It's similar to the iPhone contacts app. I don't want to open it up because I might get some personal information that people don't want you guys to see. And recents on the bottom left is just um, all your recent calls, who have you called, um, who has called you, and who ha you have um, answered to. And Overall, guys, um, this app is pretty simple to use. Again, the link to this will be in the description. Um, it is not an official app, but it is a web app, so therefore you can use it with any um, with any iPhone or iPod Touch. Um, however, there is another way that you can use Google Voice, and this is um, by going to the Google Voice website which I will load up for you guys right now. As you can see, I'm Googling it. And if you load up Google's page, you will eventually be able to find that they have a web app as well. Um, so it's pretty cool, guys. Um, I highly recommend this app. It is completely free. Um, just go to the link in the description on your iPod or iPod on your iPod or iPhone, and you'll be able to download the app 100% free. Um, overall, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I will be doing more iPhone app reviews in the future, so leave a comment. And tell me if you like this or what you would want me to do. Um, also, please like this video as I will greatly appreciate it and rate it as well as subscribe for future videos. Thanks guys. And also visit my blog which the link is in the description. I will have some other updates there for you guys too. Thanks for watching and catch you later.